Um, you're my problem solving experts, and I'm gonna to come to you with a problem. So, I own a building, and again, I'm a multi-billionaire, and this is one of my buildings. Um, and in that building is an elevator. And people live in this building, it's not an office building, um, but they're starting to say that they're gonna break their lease, they're gonna move out, because they're frustrated by the elevator, because the elevator is too slow for them. You know, there's like, I like the, the building, but you know, I'm waiting two, three minutes just to get to my apartment, and I'm tired of that. So you gotta fix this elevator, you gotta make it faster, you gotta do something, I'm tired of this. So I come to you and I say, guys, what do I need to do to keep people living in my building? I can't have them move out. So anyone have any ideas yet? Make two. Make, the elevator. make two. I can't make two because the building, the structure of the building won't allow for two. two yeah. Well, then depends on what the building looks like. If the building has one of the rooms, you could make uh, an escalator instead of just pushing it back. Yeah, that's, that's a good idea. Okay, make it, try making an escalator, yeah? Stairs, well, also yeah. We can assume it has stairs, but maybe they don't want it. Maybe they're like, I come in with my groceries and I can't, you know. Say it again. Okay. Think about the problem. Building expansion. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That, do some research, that's a good idea. All right, what if I do, okay, one more, yeah. Well, we could always update the Oh, like the technology, make it a little faster? Yeah, that's, that's a good idea. What if I told you that the problem isn't the elevator? <laughs> it, 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 it actually is the people, did you say that? Yeah. What if I told you the cheapest solution, and the best solution, had nothing to do with the elevator? And the way you fix the problem is with mirrors. Because if you put a mirror right here, or right here, okay, think about yourself. You come, you press that button, and you start waiting for the elevator. What's the next thing you're going to do if there's a mirror? Look in the mirror. You're going to look in the mirror, right? You're going to look, check yourself out. You're going to like, pick yourself up, and all of a sudden, time goes by a lot faster when you're doing something to distract you, right? And so the problem, the way that it was shown to us, was all about the elevator. Because people standing there having nothing to do are gonna feel time a lot differently than when they have a mirror and they can look at something that they love the most, right? So, mirrors are a perfectly good solution. And so this type of thing is called reframing the problem. So if you're looking at the problem and you say, okay, well, let me take a step back and get a sense of why is this a problem? Why is a slow elevator a problem, right? It has nothing to do with the speed of the elevator. Maybe the elevator is going as fast as it can. Maybe the, the technology behind the elevator is as fast as it can be, right? So maybe it's something else. And maybe it's just that people don't like waiting, which is a common problem, right? All right.